Hey guys, on today's video, we're going to show you how to update a few apps. So let's just get right to this in your app store. Let's just go right into there. You guys will see your last, well, second last option will be updates. So let's just tap right down here. So that's down here below in the bottom. You guys will see updates and then you see search. All right. So here we're going to see all the updates that we need. Okay. So it's for all these apps that we have updates right now. And we're going to update every single one of these. All right. So let's say you guys are looking for an update and don't see it right here. Let's say it's Fortnite. So let's just go into search, which is our last option here. And we're going to type in Fortnite. Let's just search for that. And we're going to see it right here. Right here, we should see the update. So we can just tap on update and it's going to update. Now that's for any app really. Okay. Any app that needs an update will be right there. So if you go to search again, let's just do another example, for example, Instagram. So let's just tap that in and right here, I'm going to see update. So I can just tap on update for Instagram. Okay. So if there's a certain update and you guys don't see it here for some reason, there's new features that come with it. So maybe you guys have to update your iOS. So let's get down to that. So under settings, all right, you guys will see general. So that's down here. You guys will see general. And then your second option will be software update. If you guys tap on software update, you guys will see if you have the latest iOS. So maybe you guys are in iOS 10 and right now is the time to update to iOS 12. So that way, after you update your iOS, you're able to update your apps because some updates for apps are only compatible with certain iOSs. So there might be an app update for a certain app, but it's only going to be compatible with a certain iOS. All right. So if you guys are already stuck, maybe in iOS 9, for example, if you have an iPad 2 and really can't update it to the newest iOS 12, don't worry about it. Whatever updates you guys need, you guys will get. Certain updates are just not compatible with your iPad and there's really no way around that. If you guys have an iPad 2, like I said, and stuck in iOS 9, then again, don't fall for any scams that you guys see online. There's a ton of scams that will tell you that you guys can update to the latest iOS. However, they're also all fake and there's a lot of viruses out there. So don't fall for those. If you guys look for stuff like that, you guys will come along jailbreaking. Jailbreaking, yes, it's great, but it's still not going to let you update to the latest iOS. Jailbreaking will just open up a whole new thing for you. It's a whole new world, jailbreaking. And I do recommend that for older iDevices. So any old iPads, yes, jailbreaking is pretty good. However, yes, do it on your own risk. It's also free, by the way, so never pay for that either. However, right now, we're going to go one by one and update them. So the very first one is Bumble. Then we have Amazon. Then we have Microsoft Outlook. We have Periscope, Pinterest, Reddit, Snapchat, Spotify. You can also click up here where it says update all. You guys can just update them all. But I just want to show you one by one anyways. So down here we have Uber, eBay, Google Photos. Okay, Facebook. And then we have New York Times, LinkedIn, RMB, and WeChat. Then we have Twitter, Acrobat, Bitmoji, Netflix, Flip, of course, YouTube. Then we have Google Maps. We have BK. Messenger, Skype, Google Docs, Microsoft OneDrive, Dropbox, Google Drive, Google Chrome, and Tumblr. So those are all the updates I see for now. However, like I said, up here, you guys can also see it says update them all. So you guys could just tap on update all and you're done. But again, I just wanted to show you all the apps that are available right now for update. Anyways, that's it for this video tutorial. If you guys have any questions, comments, you guys can write them down here in the comments area. And don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.